cardio for your face. That interests me. What is that? Oh my God, it is 4.45 a.m. Obviously you've heard of workouts for your body, but what about workouts for your face? I've heard a little bit about this just because I guess face yoga is a thing that celebrities do. So face gym, they don't call themselves face yoga. They're like a whole unique thing of themselves. They have a studio in LA and you can go in and you can get treatments and workouts done there, but they also do online classes, which is obviously good for COVID times. So this is what Face Gym's website says it is. Our workouts aren't for the faint-hearted. They're defined by their signature massage techniques to stimulate blood circulation and collagen, boost the lymphatic system, and increase cell renewal. I mean, I'm getting older, I'm in my 30s, and I definitely have noticed that I'm getting lines. Not that it's like the biggest deal in the world, obviously aging is a thing that's gonna happen to everyone, but I am I'm curious to see if working it out will help. So I'm gonna sign up for a month's unlimited classes. They're 20 minutes each, they're twice a day. You can choose how many times a week you wanna do it. I think I'm gonna do it four times a week. They also sell a ton of products online and I bought their essential workout kit, which actually isn't available anymore. They have a different kit now, but I'm gonna work with what I have. And then I also just ordered their sculpting tool. It was sold out before, but now they have it in stock. So I'll have that sometime in the future of this video. Let's get working out. It is day one and I am sitting in my bed because I guess I could work out my face anywhere. So that's a bonus. I am ready for my class. I have all my accoutrements. Is this the right way around? No. So I realized the classes are EST and I'm on the West Coast. So the classes are five in the morning. So I doubt I'll be going to them and 5 p.m. So it's about to be 5 p.m. Got my laptop ready. I've never actually done a Zoom class of anything before. So this is gonna be interesting. Tonight's class is called Power Lift and it says it's a full face lift. Ho -ho, focusing on neck, jaw, cheeks and eyes to lift all the face contours. It's high intensity. Just can't imagine what that means, but we'll find out. You're going to want to start by taking your right hand on the side of the head on the opposite side and just giving a nice stretch right down here. Time to put the face oil on. Sweet hands, right? Oh my god, this smells so good. It's like, I guess, citrusy maybe? You're just going to kind of caterpillar those fingers back and forth, starting along the jawline for a few seconds each, and then we're going to work our way up to the corners of the eyes. I finished my first class. My face feels so warm because I'm not used to touching it that much. Look how red I am. There was a lot of like, you know, massaging the face and stuff, which I'm not used to doing. It was interesting. There were some really interesting moves. I do feel like my blood is circulating better and stuff right now. So I'm really excited to see how this progresses. I feel like I look completely crazy because I got my eyebrows done today, nano bladed, and they are very thick. I can't touch them either. So I'm gonna have to go like around. Today's class is stretch and reset. And it's a new class. So I'm excited to see what kind of it's a very creaky floor. I guess it's not really a workout class, it's more of a reset class. But I can use that because I'm quite tired. Okay, so she's saying that this is to relax the facial muscles and to let them repair. I've only done one class so far, so they don't really need repairing, but it'll be good to see what kind of techniques they use. She's asking me to do forehead sweep. I don't want to sweep too close to my eyebrows. Sweep. Sweet. All right, I'm done. I do feel pretty refreshed and pretty relaxed. My face isn't as red as it was last time, but it was interesting. They were talking about lymphatic drainage. So they say lymphatic drainage helps drain excess fluid, nourish and detoxifies your tissue and will add even more definition to the face. Wow, all right. I do like the serum on the face. I'm luckily not an oily person. I'm very dry. So like any serum on my face feels nice. I do kind of wish the classes were longer than 20 minutes because it goes by so quickly. I feel like I could use more, but then again, and at least it's not taking up your whole night and it's just like in and out. So I just finished day three and this was a power lift class. And this one was kind of like more amped up. Like the, there was music playing the whole time, like pumped up music, which was kind of cool. And the moves did feel faster. The one thing I will say is I bought this whole like online kit of things. I haven't used anything but the serum. So I would like to see more use of like the item called the essential online kit. Why is it essential if I'm not using them? 
Oh my god, it is 4.45am and I said I would never do the 5am class but I realised that I can't do tonight's class at 5 and this is the only other option. I'm doing it from my bed and it's just a lip plump today. I don't think I care enough to do a lip plump at 5am but here we are. Well, I did it because it was only 20 minutes which is so nice. I definitely feel a little bit more awake now but I'm still going back to bed. There's a lot of whipping going on and a lot of motions like this to um, smooth out your nasal lid your folds which are these things i'm not gonna judge yet but i just can't imagine massaging wrinkles away like does that really work i also need to be dressed different i kept like throwing my airpods out by mistake this is just getting in the way there's a lot of like neck involved and i just i think i need to be like in the sports bra or something so that i'm more prepared <laughs> I'm about to do my fifth class. I feel like I kind of know what I'm doing a little bit more now. This is a full face hit class. Cardio for your face, that interests me. What is that? So I have my laptop right here and we're warming up right now. This is the fourth different teacher of the five classes I've done. So I've only had one teacher twice, but they've all been really good so far. I've liked them all. They're really easy to understand and they're very friendly. We're doing whipping, which is, this is what it is. It definitely does get my blood flow going, but I don't really understand how it's supposed to give you more definition. This is apparently the cardio though. I definitely learned something new. I look naked. I definitely feel like every time I do learn something new, like they do a different move every time. So it doesn't ever get boring. And then there are like the signature moves that they do a lot. There's a lot of like drainage stuff like this, which I enjoy. It's kind of relaxing. I actually used my roller for the first time the other day. I'm still waiting for my sculpting tool in the mail. It's been well over two weeks because there's a class that's dedicated to this tool and I really want to try it. So hopefully that will arrive at some point. Honestly, the last three days I couldn't even do any classes because I've been on a big shoot and I am so stressed out and I really want to relax. So I'm very much looking forward to this. So today is a new class. I haven't done this one before, lower face blast. So we just started. And one of the cool things that I've noticed a couple times, they've had another face gym person in the Zoom room to answer questions on the chat if you have any. One of the things they say every class is to pay attention to your breathing, just like in yoga or when you're working out. We're just gonna do some nice outward and downwards movements. You're gonna wanna make sure that you're getting the entire area of the sheet. She's telling me to do a side by side because we've only done this side so far and supposedly this side's supposed to be more lifted. Uh, you tell me. I can't tell. The last like few times I've done class, I've noticed they've like overran, kind of gone on to like 30 minutes, which I wasn't mad about because I feel like 20 minutes is so short that like you don't really get to do a lot. But today the teacher said that she's so glad that we have these longer classes now. And so I guess the classes have been extended to 30 minutes and I just haven't been told. Something I realized in my class tonight, I have never seen one dude in our classes. Clearly, it's just a bunch of women doing this to try and like not look old. Whereas men don't give a crap because men look attractive when they're old. And I'm just realizing this is another like the beauty standard thing that women have to adhere to and men don't. So face gym, although it has an air of fitness about it, it's still mainly about beauty and it's not face gym's fault, but this just sucks. I am halfway through week three. I am just getting really tired of having to be available at 5 p.m. every single time I want to do this. I'm so not used to classes anymore because of the pandemic. Like I just make my own schedule when it comes to like running or like doing workouts at home. I really can't tell if it's working or not and I hate to say that because I want it to work. I mean, I'm definitely paying more attention to my face than I ever have. I'm definitely doing more for it than I've ever done. One thing I'm getting really frustrated with is how many times I have to take my makeup off to do this. I guess I don't take my makeup off usually when I work out. I just do it with my makeup on, which is gross. Probably not making uh, my face any younger. With these half hour classes, it definitely gives you more time to like warm up and cool down and use the little tools. We're doing the cool down. I'm done for another day. That was kind of cool because she was saying how the moves that we were doing were to increase collagen in the skin so at least I feel like it is doing something and that there's science behind it. Okay I have some pretty exciting news after three weeks of waiting I have the multi sculpt tool. There is an entire class dedicated to this and I've wanted to try it for three weeks. Let's do the class. So one of the things they just said was that the reason this tool specifically is really good is because it's hypoallergenic steel. It's not like any other material that might irritate you and that it has six edges. I guess one, two, three, four, I don't know. 
There are six apparently. So I guess there's a lot of different things you can do with it. It is cool using a tool. Like I'm used to using my fingers. So it's nice to have something that you know is like deliberately made for the thing you're doing. So I'm kind of excited for today's class because this is the first yoga face class that I'm going to be doing. And I feel like I've heard of face yoga before. Maybe I'll get to use this ball that I've had the entire time. Okay, this is a great move to uh, loosen your jaw because I'm so like all the time. This class is interesting because it's a lot about tension release. The ball has not been used. Now I have my sculpting tool. I'm able to do some cool down moves. It is the last day and I'm being really quiet because I have a downstairs neighbour and it is 5am. I have something going on at 5pm today. Today is lip pump and plump. I wish it was a whole face one to be honest. So it's a teacher I've never had before because I don't ever do the really early class. Also she just showed like a diagram of the face like with all the muscles and stuff and told us what we were going to be working on so that was kind of cool. Well I'm very glad that's done. I definitely woke my face up a little bit. I feel like the blood is now coursing through my veins. So my 30 days are over. In complete honesty, I don't know what it's done for the aging of my face. I'm sure if I did it for like six months, I might see a difference, but it's not like it feels any tighter or anything. It might be because I see my face every day and I don't notice the changes, but I do like the relaxation aspect of it and the self-care aspect of it. I would be curious to go into the studios and try their in-studio sessions. But yeah, main takeaway, self-care, especially in COVID times it's important.